everybody. Welcome to Kimmel's Irish Pub. Time for another movie review. Tonight's movie is Archive. Um, Theo James and Rona Murta are in it. 6.3 on IMDb. I don't have my phone. 6.3 or 6.4 on IMDb. Um, just came out. It's a futuristic movie about somebody who's developing what I think is like a robot with artificial intelligence. Um, and it's almost perfected. It's in 2038. So that's only 18 years away. Um, and uh, there's a sensitive phase, which is the riskiest, um, because the goal of this guy who's building this is hidden at all costs because he is trying to reignite with his dead wife. So I'm assuming, just guessing based on what I've read, which isn't much, is that the robot or the artificial intelligent being that they're creating, which I think is a robot, is probably going to be his wife, reincarnation of his wife. So I don't know. Who knows? I don't know. Not me. That's why I'm here. I'm going to get into it here, find out what it's about, give you a better idea, then ultimately let you know what I think. So, stick around. I'll be back. Hey everybody, we're at the uh, credits of Archive. No check-ins tonight. Very interesting. Um, you know, and why there's no. I thought it was okay for a while, but uh, I'll be honest with you. When I when I found it and I, I looked it up on IMDb and I scrolled and it said somebody had a nine out of ten, and they said I already know I already seen it once. I know how it ends, and I'm watching it a second time. Or I just got done watching it for a second time, even though I know already how it ends. That kind of thing. So I was like, okay. So that was the only thing I saw besides the synopsis, and uh, I'll break that down for you real quick. So the synopsis again. And I think it'll help because the, the beginning of the, the synopsis isn't so clear. And then the beginning of the movie is not that clear. And that's probably why I didn't check in because you don't really grasp it all right away. Um, and I think it's well done that way and it makes it more fun. But I think it also, it's not going to hurt you if you understand it a little bit more. Just a little bit. It's in the future and Theo James is some kind of crazy awesome scientist kind of guy who... Um, you know, can develop robots and, and artificial intelligence, like that kind of stuff. And his wife dies, right? And we know that. And so he's trying to, you know, uh, recreate, and they lead you down this path, um, a, a robot that maybe might have his uh, a wife, his wife into it, or trying to make something like his wife to come back, you know. But, I mean, it's not, like, super lifelike. There's, like, trials and stuff like that. Meanwhile, there's this archive thing, and that's why it's called archive, where basically her, she is alive, not alive, she's like video conferencing with him a little bit, um, you know, so you can see it's in the future and there's some kind of technology that's allowing that to happen, you're not sure how that's being powered and all that continues to, to play itself out, but it all happens in the beginning and there are some flashbacks, um, you know, for him with his wife, so it caught me a couple times. I was like, wait a minute, what's going on? So just keep that in mind. Um, that's really all you need to know. And it'll help you, I think, enjoy the film a little bit more as it continues to progress. There are just little pieces of it. I'm not spoiling it for you. It happens, like I said, in the beginning. And, and you totally get it. And um, it, I, get, I think it'll help you enjoy the film a lot more. That's just me. Um, it, I, once you figure that out, it's like, okay, all right, and then you can sit back and, and enjoy it, but then, you know, then it speeds up a little bit, and there's no time for checking in, so there's why there's no check-in, um, but, you know, reading that and then watching the film, you think to yourself, what, I do this in every movie, how's it going to end, what's the twist, what can they do here, you know, and that's part of the fun, and I think it even makes it more fun when it's like, oh, you know? <laughs> so, um, that's all I'll say for you there. If you like Theo James, I mean, it's just him and, um, I don't even know the other girl. I think she was, let's get her name for you. I mean, I, I know uh, Rona Murta was in it. I said that. Um, very limited role in this. Um, Stacy Martin is the, the other girl's name, his wife, right? So... You know, so it's really, if you like him, if you don't like him, you're not going to like this movie because it's 97% him. 
and I do like him. I think he he's from um, Divergent series, you know, and some other things, but I remember him from that, so I, I kind of like him. Um, but this was a nice little gem, I think uh, I found. Yeah, um, <laughs> really interesting. When I, yeah, I don't even know what to say. You know, there's parts of it where it's like, oh, okay, that's where they're going with this. Oh, you know, all right, it's good. And then, no, that's not what they meant. There was more to it. And I was like, whoo -hoo. You know, I know, that's like vague, Jeff, what are you talking about? But that's all you're getting from me. Um, if you like futuristic, iRobot, um, Ex Machina type movies, you'll like this one. Absolutely, I think it's a nice one for you. Um, and then just sit back and relax and enjoy. Don't read any more about it. If you've watched me and you haven't seen it yet, go check it out. If you have checked it out, I'd love to hear your thoughts. I am, hmm, I'm on a seven train here, I think. This one was at six, maybe seven. I don't know. It's good. Yeah, I, I, I like it. I'm pleasantly surprised, and hopefully you will too. But again, you have to be more of a, like a sci-fi robot, um, AI kind of. I don't want to, you know, I mean, uh, be interested in that kind of stuff, or at least movies about that stuff, so, there you go, that's what I got for you, um, like I said, if you've seen it already, drop me some comments, what do you think, did you like it, um, and, uh, if you haven't already, go ahead and watch it, if you like the things that I talked about, and hopefully you enjoy it, so, there you go, that's it for me, if, uh, you haven't already, subscribe to my channel, that'd be fantastic, and of course, tell all your friends, and continue to come back. Kimmel's Irish Pub.